Next, let's take a look at the channel strip. So this is new for Pro Tools 10. It has compression and EQ, dynamics, all kinds of stuff built into it. So again, following the same process, trying to find that rhythm. I can back off. Use the threshold. So you can see what the gain reduction is. And the other thing I want to do is I'm going to use their filter. It's a high pass filter. So I can roll this up. So if you listen to this, as I'm as I'm changing, you can hear that I'm removing all the low end, but it's okay because I'm I'm really using this more for the the upper the the high mids and the highs, giving a character towards that bass. The sub bass is what's gonna carry that that super low end sound that we that we're looking for.